It feels so wrong, but it also feels so right. Drinking Monster at 9.01 in the morning. And it only feels so right because I think, literally guys, I think I'm flat out addicted to Monster. I'm having caffeine with your himbine in the morning while I do cardio because the two works together very well as a fat burner. So I think I'm starting to get like a bit addicted to caffeine. Like yesterday, I went the whole day without having any caffeine. And I was like absolutely starving like all day. I was just gagging for like something. I couldn't work out what it was. I was starving hungry. And then like a few hours before I trained, it dawned on me like I was gagging for a monster. Had a monster and all appetite went away. Like I was completely fine. And I think I'm just flat out addicted to caffeine now. <laughs> so we're starting the day nice and healthily with a Monster Ultra. This is pretty much what all my mornings look like, by the way. I read in the car because it's very unhealthy to spend so much time at home. Like, I think a lot of the reason why I got like clinically depressed last year, um, a number of reasons, but one of them was because I was just spending so much time at home without a car, like doing all my work in my room. The book we're currently reading is Jordan Peterson's 12 Rules of Life. It's a close race between child and self. The sacrifice of the mother offering her child to the world is exemplified profoundly by Michelle Mengo's... Oh. <laughs> Michael Angelo's... <laughs> Michelle Yango's... As you can see from this video, I don't know how we're going to see it because I haven't actually thought of the name at this moment in time. But the name of the series is this. If you thought of the name of the series, um, I have some wobs coming to you. Leave your... I, I don't I don't fucking know. I haven't actually decided the name yet. But by the time this video is out, I will have a name for this cutting series. Welcome to episode number two of this cutting series. And uh, of this cutting series. New low weigh this morning at 196 pounds. That means we've lost over five kilos. We've lost over 10 pounds in pretty much mostly body fat. Like obviously I'm gonna lose some muscle as well. I'm just starting to feel prep. Like the low calories are like kind of starting to kick in. Prep is well underway boys and girls. This was my check-in to my coach this morning, Josh Bridgman. This is how I'm looking. Like as you can see, I'm looking pretty fucking sick compared to like what I was originally like. I've brought it in loads i kind of just want to like get you on to get you like updated like so we're on the same level because like these videos are a little bit behind so by showing you my physique now this is where i'm currently at at this moment in time and you're going to be like in real time rather than like a couple of weeks behind me if you know what i mean people have started to get wobs um people have started to get wobs yesterday i think it was but most of you guys have all of them are going to get them over the next few days shipping was on the 15th of february so it's three to five working days from the uk some came a bit earlier five to seven working days for the rest of the world from the 15th of February. The feedback so far has been fucking great. I'll go over it more in the next video and answer any questions that you guys may have. And uh, hell yeah. Also, Wob Hats, I still have all colors available. I've probably sold about half of the stock. These ones right here, these fucking beautiful hats. Ah. I get like really sensitive. If you want to support your boy and grab a wob, wob hat, and if I see you wearing one of these at a festival, I will literally whip my dick out and like ejaculate all over you. Um, if you want one of those, go and join the Facebook group in the link down below. Wob Squad is basically just like a community page where we just talk about fitness and festivals and stuff anyway. Like, I don't really benefit from it. It's just so you guys and we can like connect with each other. There's a post on there on how to get one. First pin post. If you want one, head down there below. And then once I've sold these, I'll look into doing the crazy weird festival hats. You know, Right now in this video, we're about to go back in time you guys kept asking me to train with tom get a session with tom blah 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 blah, blah. so i did exactly that hooked up with tom we drove up to just watch the video drove up with tom trained just watch it mate what's dion's drum fucking um dj name gonna be what's his dj name yeah, what's, what's it gonna, what's it gonna be? No, what's it gonna be? Ascot. It? <laughs> He's gonna be called Ascot. <laughs> DJ Ascot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, oh my god. This is so dodgy. Three, two, one. Ah! How do you open this shit? I can't open it. Bro, I didn't actually open it. Four kids, mate. It's so bad. I need piss as well. I've consumed about 50,000 milligrams of caffeine today. Mate, look at the night vision on this camera. It's better than real life. Right, right. 
This is ISO 100. This is ISO. How did yours go to ISO 100? I ISO 1 million. What? <laughs> ISO half a million. Really? It's the, mate, it's the A72, mate. Mate, it's the A72. Mate. Ditch my phone now. Are you ready to train? Right, today we are in a place called Swindon, which is a shithole. But, well, we're not actually in Swindon. We're in a place called Siren Sister. And basically, this is where the factory is for my wobs and where everything gets made. And it's also where my business partner lives. The guy that creates Alpha Dark Side. So we go train in his gym, Max Body's gym. Me and Tom to hit some legs. We're both doing prep, we're both in the same show. And um, I'm shredded and Tom's still fat. Let me in, sir. Sister Nazi, mate. Maybe it's juicy, Trump no. bass on. <laughs> it's good, eh? Right, buddy. How's it going, man? Lick your finger and dip it in this. Like pro proper dip, like big one. How fucking good does that taste? Decent. What is it? I can literally spoon it out. That's yeah, I don't know what it tastes like. That's why I call it unicorn blood because every other garb shop is calling everything unicorn. Is this um? Is this dark side? Yeah. It's, uh, oh man, this tastes so good. Oh god. <laughs> What's that? Cash <laughs> tray flavour. <laughs> <laughs> Never tried it before. That's good, mate. That that's the best flavour. Uh, man, I think you'll need at least three. Do not give that. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it kill me once? That is a message from that kid. Man, I got a message from some kid at 4am. It was like, um, do, do they put drugs in this? It's 4am, like, I can't sleep or some shit. That's so easy to dome as well. Right, we've got 1,000 hand-printed, like, little gift card things. These took me, so, like, all of the thousands of these things, oh, yeah, it'll be fine, I'll fill them all out gradually, it'll be fine, or, like, basically, what each of these is going to go in every product that we sent out, which is kind of, like, a little thank you from me and make it, like, personalised. Got to, like, two days before the product is shipping out, I was like, fuck. I got a thousand of these to write. So I literally stayed up pretty much all night yesterday writing these. Felt like I've been jacking off for about 10 hours. My hand. Like, I'm sorry if you've all the wobs and you can't read some of these because, like, my hand literally had no feeling in it. Got these to Adrian, brought them up to the place where the widow get the product shipped from and our factory because everything's made here in the UK. And, uh. And yeah. Hey. No. Oh, you'll get one. I'll get you one anyway. But... <laughs> no. I don't know if I'll give it to her yet though. Today, so far we've had one monster for breakfast, an Americano coffee for lunch, a, do you know the large monsters for resealable tops? We have one of those for like dinner, and now we're having a scoop of Alpha Dark Side, so I don't think I'm going to sleep for about two weeks. <laughs> Sit. No, just <laughs> just edit, just edit a crying baby into that. <laughs> right, Tom, to warm up, mate. I wanted to use the um, the death machine. There's this like half treadmill, half stairmaster thing, and you like start to walk on it, and it gets out of time and just gets faster and faster and faster. It looks like it's going out of time. I'm walking like I'm about to enter a fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, <Mo. laughs> Wait, put it a bit faster. Wednesday, yeah? Yes, it's Wednesday. Um, I'm meant to be training doubts and arms today. I mean, I'm meant to do doubts and arms today, so we're actually doing doubts and arms instead. I actually am meant to train doubts and arms today. Basically, my split that I'm on is different. I'll do a video on it, but I'm currently training two days on, one day off, and it's like a mixed body part split, so it's like really variable, if you know what I mean. So it doesn't go by a seven day week where you have like Monday, Tuesday, you train this. It basically changes it every single week. So it's 
Battle from there, we've got to sneak up. And you don't even not expect it, they're just back. <laughs> right, two sets of face pulls for activation. So light, lots of failure. And we'll do a shoulder press. <laughs> One day I'm gonna like try and play fight and it's just gonna like Do you know how it was how it had the bro player it was going Yeah just grab my fucking And just te tear all your arteries and veins out <laughs> no, and mate, it doesn't even do that, it just picks me up by the waist <laughs> <laughs> Does a fucking death roll with you. Oh mate, you've got a right, you've got to run hundred meters, yeah? With two twenty kilo plates in your hand. And he gets to start 100 meters <laughs> back. And if he gets to the, and he wants to kill you, if you get to the finish line, you get a million pounds, would you do it? No, obviously not. Fuck me! Come on! Ready? Yeah. Look at the legit on the tricep right the there. The freaky mate. tricep. It is the... Bro, it's not even going on. Did you have that? Going. No. Did you get some momentum? Mate, I trained like fucking, not yesterday, day before. Fuck your self-limiting beliefs. Well, I want to point out that it's currently February in England and this is basically like an industrial unit warehouse gym. If you're from England or anywhere where the gyms are like that, so I haven't got a pump in probably about six months. Anyway guys, you got me back in present time, sat in the chair, talking to you, watching this video. I'm not actually watching the video that you guys are watching right now, so we're going to have to guess how long it is. But this was like, I think it's about 7 to 10 days ago from when I'm recording this video. So as you can see, like, I've lost a significant amount of body fat since this is getting filmed. Like, I'm a lot leaner and it's pretty crazy. I'm probably about 3, three pounds lighter, 2 pounds lighter. I'm losing about 2 pounds a week on average. But yeah, guys, Wobs are finally getting out there. The feedback has been absolutely sick. Like, I was so nervous. Like, that morning when I heard people are getting, people are getting them before me because I ran out of the samples, so I'm getting them with, like, the rest of the orders, like, when you guys get them. And I can see on Instagram, people were, like, getting them, and I was getting all these, like, hundreds upon hundreds of messages from people like, oh, I can't wait to try these, blah, 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 blah. And I was so scared. Like, I was so fucking scared. Like, about, like, it's one thing. I don't know if you can put yourself in my shoes, like, I've never really, because I've never really done this for anyone else, someone that owns a business. But, like, imagine having, like, a solid five figures of people's money. One, imagine having all that money and then you haven't sent products out yet because it's a pre-order. That is massively stressful. Imagine having all of that and then, like, getting every single one of these orders out and making sure that every single person is happy and like you don't know and you've never done anything like this in your life before and there's like such large amounts of money at play and there's so many like hundreds hundreds of people like it's fucking scary guys it's it's so i can't explain to you how scary it was waiting for the messages and when when i started to get messages from you guys saying like holy holy shit this stuff is legit like i was so, i couldn't tell you how relieved i was like i could not tell you how relieved I was. I want to say thank you so much. Just like, honestly, man, like I'm, I've really put myself out by trying to do this and trying to do things differently. And I just wanted to bring, I don't want to, like you guys, I care so much about um, like, I don't know if integrity is the right, right word or a set of beliefs, a set of things that I stand for. I care so much about bringing you guys something and being honest and like actually giving you something legit that I would get myself over like making money that like I just want everything to be perfect and go perfectly, you know? You, you know what I mean? 
Anyway, it was some scary, scary shit. We are making moves, boys. I want to let you know as well that I'm going to be in Paris soon. FIBO Paris, not FIBO Paris. I'm going to be in Paris for the Paris Fit Expo. I'm going to be in Germany for FIBO. I'm going to be at Body Power all weekend. And I'm also seeing about arranging maybe a, like, a wob drum and bass night in a club in Birmingham when that is on. Like, I haven't actually got anything sorted yet. But we're, we're like kind of, we're looking to do that. I'm, we're making some moves. Also, I'm going to be in Portugal for 10 days in the middle of May. If you're in Portugal, you want to hit me up or anything, I'm going to be in South Portugal doing a skydiving course. That was on one of my goals for this year. So I was like, fuck it. I'm going to go sky, get my skydiving license doing that. And yeah, guys, like, I just can't, cannot wait to meet you all at the fucking expos. Like, it's so sick. There is loads and loads of stuff going on in my life at the moment. And it's super exciting. And I can't wait. And it's almost summer and it's almost time for first. Oh, yeah, I was going to plug this as well. Uh, VQ, new VQ range. Oh, what are they called? I don't even. I'm not even gonna lie to you and search a name and pretend that I know the name of this VQ line. This VQ line with the oversized hoodies and the oversized t-shirts is absolutely dope. I've actually gone and ordered a load more just because I really like them, especially the t-shirts. Like the fit, like I said at the start, is absolutely sick. If you want to support me, if you want to check them out, you can go to the site. But there is a link down below which supports me and I get like an affiliate commission if you buy anything through that link. So that would be dope. I appreciate that. There is no more codes. They don't, VQ do not do discount codes anymore. They discontinued them. So the only thing I do have and anyone else is a link. And if you want to check it out, even if you don't, want to, don't buy anything, like I appreciate you clicking through a link because it makes you look better. I'm speaking really fast. Um, I've got to edit this video in half an hour and go to the gym because another one of my goals this week is trying to be on time because I'm late for absolutely anything. But anyway, guys, keep killing it. I love you to bits. Um, thank you so much for release for Wobs and everyone that grabbed the hat as well. Thank you very, very much. Peace out. I love you. Bye.